Добрый день. Традиционно хотел бы сказать огромное спасибо своей команде, которая все это время, невзирая там, на все сложности, находилась рядом со мной, тренерам, друзьям, которые приехали меня поддержать, семье, которая переживает дома, следит за моими боями, за подготовкой. Ну и, конечно же, всем любителям бокса желаю приятных впечатлений от 21 числа. Спасибо. Uh, good afternoon, everybody. Just wanted to thank to all my training camp people, trainers who helped me to prepare for this fight. I wanted to thank my family who is uh, supporting me from overseas. I wanted to thank my friends who came to see me here, to flew from Ukraine to support me here. Uh, thanks to, to all the fans who's going to be watching. I think very good fight on the Saturday night. Thank you very much. And now to introduce to you uh, one of the most talented fighters uh, in, in the sport today. Uh, not only does he possess the speed, but the, uh, the power uh, uh, behind his punches. Uh, he was the 2008 uh, United States Olympian. Uh, he, uh, he has wins over fighters uh, with, with a lot of experience. Uh, using his uh, his angles and his speed and his, his power. Um, this fighter really possesses something special, uh, which we feel uh, we haven't seen in a long time. A fighter who uh, is going up against another fighter who has all that experience, uh, and that's why, that's why this fight is so compelling. But when you have a fighter who possesses that, that kind of talent that you don't see uh, very often, uh, you know, you, you definitely want to watch. And you, and you definitely don't want to blink because not only with his speed but his power, uh, combining both can, uh, can knock anybody out. So it is my pleasure to introduce to you, out of Capitol Heights, Maryland, with a record of 24-0 and, and 14 knockouts, Gary Russell Jr. This is actually a little funny standing here and getting ready to speak for a world title based on the fact that I was never one of these fighters that said I wanted to be a world champion. That was never a goal of mine, it was never something that I wanted to accomplish until, like you said before, I was on the 2011 team. Um, I was one of the favorites to, to actually be medal there, and unfortunately, I didn't get a chance to. Um, it was devastating, and to not compete, I felt the way. I felt it was the only way to make it up to my fans, to the people, to the people that genuinely supported me. The only way to make it up to them was to become world champion. It was, it was after the Olympics when I wanted to become world champion. You know, it's kind of it's kind of weird because in this situation you kind of get the opportunity to kill two birds with one stone. We have my opponent, who's a gold medalist in the Olympics. I suppose to compete in the Olympics. I felt as though I possess everything that I've always to come home with a gold medal. And this kind of helps me answer some questions to them myself. You know, so you get out some kill two words in one song. Make it up to my fans by becoming a world champion on the 21st. I make it up to myself by beating the gold medal. I see y'all on the 21st. Thank you very much, Gary. So now for the main event. The main event uh, will be will be one of those fights where, uh, where people are are really really looking forward to uh, because of styles, uh, because of what what they possess inside the ring, of how they trained, uh, of of what they bring to the table. Uh, both fighters, what they bring to the table is is. Is, is not only speed and power, but courage, and, and they bring to the table uh, uh, that, that champion fighting spirit. 
Uh, let me introduce to you first, uh, he's back in Carson, uh, fighting for the second time. Uh, he did have a hard uh, battle, uh, a fight uh, that was uh, a very competitive fight against John Perez in 2013. Uh, he's coming off a, uh, a string of wins uh, after his loss against John Perez. Uh, but we feel we feel that uh, that that he's ready and, and, and back. Uh, uh, obviously, uh, uh, prepared to take on his biggest challenge uh, of his career. He hails out of Tokyo, Japan, with a record of 24 and one and 21 knockouts. Yoshihiro Kamegai. Yoshihiro. Hello everyone. Uh, first of all, I'd like to thank Golden Boy, Showtime, all the sponsors, thank you promotions, and got everybody here uh, to make this fight possible. I'm uh, very honored to be fighting a great fighter like Roberto Guerrero. I have the highest respect for him, but in the ring, it's obviously the same. Uh, you know, I've been I joined teams with uh, 
crossfit and they were just doing so much uh, different type of work getting ready for fights so um, you know i'm ready to showcase on uh, saturday night and man, i can't wait it's been a long time so you know i'm hungry just want to thank comic guy for coming out all the way over here to fight me and uh, you know it's going to be a great one it's going to be a great one for the fans and uh, you know he comes to fight all the time i see him uh, filming on film on him and i mean he he likes to brawl it out he likes to bang guys out so um, the type of guy that likes to fight too. So, you know, I thank everybody for coming out and see you guys Saturday night. Thank you very much.